your buckle shoes And all that jazz I hear that Father Dick is gonna blow the blues And all that jazz Hold on, hon, we're gonna bunny hug About some aspirin down at United Twice One of Hollywood's most beautiful stars, Catherine Zeta-Jones has a reputation for glamour and talent. A star on film and stage, Catherine has made it. If you would read for us, please, Miss Kelly. <clears throat> I haven't worked in a while. What a laugh. Plug in Fred Casely. The big baboon had it coming. I'm just sorry I only got to kill him once. Catherine, the girl from Wales, has, with moments of luck and talent, worked her way up the Hollywood ladder. With her stunning good looks and elegant composure, Catherine finds herself in a position of being able to choose her roles. With her love of dance and music, her role in Chicago let her come to the fore and display her talent in all the varied forms of performance. Catherine went on to win an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress. Married to Michael Douglas, the couple successfully took out an injunction to stop Hello! magazine publishing unpaid for and unsolicited photos of their wedding. Well, they try to put a little bit of a, of a spin out of it. We, we went unequivocally. I'm very, very happy and grateful. I think it'll make it easier for a lot of people to deal with the, the press in England in the future as far as privacy is concerned. With husband Michael Douglas, Catherine has two children, their second child born in 2003. Right. Um, so glad that the theater is not very far from home. <laughs> Any day now, honey. Oh, no, 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 no. Any day. I'm hoping it's going to be a few weeks. A multi-award winning actress, Catherine is now a major Hollywood player. But she has not let that change her too much. Catherine is interested in producing films in Wales via her company, Milkwood Films. The musical Chicago was a huge public and critical success. Renee Zellweger, Chicago. And Catherine Zeta-Jones, Chicago. She is also using her fame and money to help worthy causes, including young adults with cerebral palsy and the International Center for Missing and Exploited Children. Alongside her career, Catherine puts her family, her two young children and husband first, despite the glamour of Hollywood. And the Oscar goes to Catherine. Everybody in Swansea, South Wales, I love you. And to my son, Dylan, who is going to be watching at home, and to my husband, who I love, and I share this award with you, along with this one, too. Thank you so much. Alongside such Hollywood heavyweights as Brad Pitt and Michelle Pfeiffer, Catherine lent her voice to the animation Sinbad, Legend of the Seven Seas, confirming her status. Still think a ship's no place for a woman? Dark-haired and brown-eyed, Catherine has the exotic looks that enables her to play a wide selection of interesting and challenging roles. She displays a strong female presence on the screen with a sharp intelligence and wit that lends her roles that extra depth to produce memorable characters. Catherine often plays strong women, decisive and fully aware of their own power and potential. Look at her, an athlete at the peak of her powers. Excuse me. Catherine is certainly at the peaks of her powers, having reached an age and place in her life with solid foundations to project her on and up into her career. You named him after your ex. I'm sentimental. When we want to embark on a romantic comedy, this is the best way to do it, you know, because romantic comedy is the hardest thing to find for one. Secondly, we always know the ending. So to have this with a bit of bite and a twist and, and you know, people who really should not be together, slowly and thoroughly falling in love because they're so mean and they enjoy each other's meanness, it's terrific. Catherine played a revengeful gold digger in Intolerable Cruelty. Catherine is a fascinating woman on screen. She is a woman with film presence that will not soon be forgotten. You fascinate me.